Well, this is the calm before the storm. There's our new air conditioner we just put in about two weeks ago. Now, because we live in a mobile home park, uh, power goes out, they pump, we have, they have two artesian wells, and uh, of course those pumps will be going down. So I got this filled with water to flush the toilets. And this is all water here. Three trash cans full of water, all for flushing the toilets, and I've got eight gallons of water for drinking and as well as bottled water, so we're set there. This greenhouse is used for storage, and I got everything tied down as much as I could. I even added a, another rope here. Just to keep things from blowing all over the yard. There's our old air conditioner down there. This is the base plate for the generator cover, which is temporarily setting over here that I made. I have an earlier video on that. I don't know if I put that up there yet or not. I'm not sure what order I'm going to be doing these in. This will probably go up first and then that construction of that will uh, be next. So we got everything tied down here. And we got a lot of trees. This is what worries me. A lot of trees. Any one of them, all it takes is one to come down and crash through the roof, and that's the end of it. Got a leaner here that's always been that way. That looks like it'll hit the shed. And then I won't be able to get my generator out, which is in there. But as you can see, that tree layer that's been there for three or four years just fell over. You an awful lot of trees here. But I wanted to get some videos of this. And if we're still here, I'll take some videos of the aftermath. And hopefully it won't be any worse than what Hurricane Gloria was, which a whole bunch of leaves like this here. And small branches, but nothing major. Hopefully. That was in 1985. We didn't have this mobile home. We had a smaller one at that time. So, this is Friday at which I'm doing this, Friday evening at which I'm doing this video right now. It's probably about 6.30 in the evening. And, uh, what we can hope for is the best. So until then, let's hope everything will be okay. Now, as I said, I have a video of the construction of this project here. And you're probably kind of wondering what it is. It's a generator cover for my little Coleman PowerMate 1850 surge generator, which will be enough to run the refrigerator. I'll put that video up on YouTube at another time. Meanwhile, I want to get this one up in the pre-storm video. If we do lose power, and I'm sure we will, the generator will be placed here. The cover will go on top of it. I don't know what we're going to do with Sally. You can't keep her in the house. And the generator will be plugged in down here, provided we're not flooded out, and provided we still have a house to come home to. Thank you for watching.